thanks for joining us here on the Geek Tech, Indu- uh, Geek Tech Industries live stream. Oh, man. <laughs> it's a good night already. It is. Stick is here. Bally here. Zila here. Hey, GTI fans. Back again? Yeah, we're, I'm, I'm Thank you to, again for joining us. Yeah, I'm just going to, you know, call it like it is tonight. As I see it, how you guys play, I'm going to call it like it is. I, I personally can't wait. It's, <laughs> I'm really looking forward to... I missed your snark, my friend. Mm. I missed your snark. <laughs> so, Wait, um, you're not going to fly? Uh, no. No? Not tonight. Not tonight. No. Not tonight. No, nope. another time soon, I, I think. Yeah, yeah, quite, quite possibly. So, um, so but we've also uh, we've been doing some other stuff in GTI. We have. So why don't you tell us actually? Yeah. Like you've been gone a while, man. Uh, like, what, what you been doing? I've been doing some Imperian Galactic Survival. Okay. Uh, and that's going really well. We okay. uh, we have a server, of course, yeah. right? And uh, um, that's cool. We get to test out our builds on on our scenarios and stuff and we uh, get to test do some of our do viewers video. might not be familiar with what uh, Imperium is why don't you just say yeah like, what, well, what is Imperium? well so it is a galactic space survival game so you basically start on a planet either by crash landing or by starting in a base pre-constructed for you of some sort or another it's maybe just a little uh, a little shack really with mm-hmm. nothing really there other than maybe keep you out of the environment okay um and you have to <clears throat> gather resources and in the way of different ores and stuff so there's you can run around mine with your your you're an avatar it runs on the unity engine so um i know it looks it's really pretty, awesome it, it look it's good it, it, it actually plays really well it's smooth yeah. if you have a half decent machine it doesn't have to be a kick-ass machine for you for you to get you know 30 frames a second um and i've played it a bunch with you it's all it's a lot of fun yeah so we we've been um um running some scenarios with the ironman competition guys too and and that's been really good you you ran an unofficial one last time yeah so i ran in the I ran, I did the, the Iron Man unofficially, just uh, I didn't quite get, uh, you know, a set up in time. Okay. Uh, but I did start the day of. So it's funny because they, they all like had a week be- before me kind of, right? Well, leading so, into, yeah. So it was like that day, it was like, oh, I got to submit this video by midnight today. Okay, well, I guess I'll just do it. Boom. And so, and, you know, it was like a one shot deal and then just submit the raw footage, really. Yeah, yeah. I mean, right? Because I'm pretty much a hack. If you, <laughs> if you look at my videos, like, you know, I mean, Dude, it's let's, like let's, our, let's face it, I'm not I'm just no like our early live major. Stuff. So, and I don't spend, well, I don't have basically a lot of time to spend editing, right? So it's it comes down to what what time I have. It's very focused. So yeah. you know, I I do now. We're actually starting to act add some stuff to our videos that that yeah. is going to give us a little bit of branding you guys are going to start seeing and it here as well yeah i might have turned the volume up on mine a little too high on the last video <laughs> so just just to let you know if you see episode five of uh of the current uh what am i running again uh, uh, the, the 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 lost, lost city of souls city of lost souls the city of lost souls. city of lost souls so Go check that out. No, the Lost City of Souls. Lost City of Souls. Yes. Okay. Yeah, it's the Lost City. So of go Souls. check that out on our channel, uh, uh, YouTube.com/slash/GeekTechIndustries. Uh, check it out under our playlists. Um, he's got some really yeah. entertaining gameplay on there. I think you guys will really enjoy it. I guess yeah. City of Lost Souls is too cliche. Yeah. Well, no, it's, it's Souls. S O L S. S O L S. So I, I'm not really sure, but the the scenario is amazing. It's a it's a a scenario that somebody <laughs> built and published. Uh, through Steam Workshop, so it's one of those game games that you can build your whole universe and publish it with anyone else on Steam. It's yeah. amazing. Yeah. It's really amazing platform to for a game like that. Yeah. Um, also, uh, it's a really tight knit community that that uh, of YouTubers that have kind of. We've started to get to know each other, well, and, folks like and Lift we're, pizzas. And... Yeah, yeah. So there's 
there's a bunch of really good guys out there that uh, are doing putting out some great videos you know um, if you go to the uh, Captain <clears throat> Adonis has uh, all the info for the Ironman and uh, when you go there it'll have all the links to the competitors and all their their sites so nice. um, right now I'm not sure about season seven but mm -hmm. uh, I'm definitely gonna be running again officially this time nice uh, so we'll have some official representation so the least. Iron Man is you have to complete a number of uh, events in your in the run game without dying without dying you have one at all. life you never all. get to die if nice. you die at all throughout the game you're done you can't die ever interesting so yeah so last season we had to do a series of of escalating uh, difficulty missions really right and, and so I kind of I kind of did put a little flare on my own little flare on them uh, you know, like you would yeah because so Control. yeah <laughs> so we'll see if they let me do it again officially um, they, it did raise a couple of flags I think when I did it they oh, were like some of the ways you well there were some people that, that said oh I was wondering when they're gonna notice that we'll have to see if that's gonna be allowed oh, now you may not be able to do you might things. not be able to do oh. that anymore it might you know so it's like yeah I know but right now it falls under the rules yeah. so it's okay but you see, know see I don't I don't cheat I exploit Look for the loopholes, everybody. <laughs> Always look for the loopholes until they get uh, fast. Is it cheating? Uh, not intentionally. Uh, not intentionally. You're not, you're not really breaking the rules. But I found this corner case where this thing happens. You know, and that's why you game lawyering. That's why I both loved and hated flying against you in X Wing because you would find these little loopholes and things that, like you're. Your weird robots build that everybody looked at and went, "What are you gonna do with that?" And then you were like, "Just watch. I'm gonna crab walk yeah. <laughs> and piss you off." Yeah, yeah. And nobody saw it coming. <laughs> so. It was yeah. Well, the first game that I, <laughs> you were you were quite I was completely perplexed. That, uh, I think we what was it? I think it was five or six rounds in a row. I did I did red S turns with them six. Rounds think, in a row. By the I fifth turn, you were like, and I slew, and I was like, again? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I was, I was so like frustrated. In a row, too. It was like, I'm like, I can do it again. Oh, I slew. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> devil like, wingman. Just, uh, just crazy. Uh, yeah. yeah, I think what, what like, they, they just, arc dodged, like, insane. They arc dodged insane, and just, and you know what? They, they took. They gave me second place a couple times, uh, two or three times in tournaments, actually, that yeah. list. Yeah. So I never quite got the winning blow in in the, in the finals. Yeah, that's, that comes but, down to pilot skill. We all know you're yeah. only so good, sir. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. We'll get you back. We'll get you back. Hopefully one day. I mean, yeah. So speaking of that, Landacy is done. Yes. Yeah. Very sad. Landacy that is gone. That sucks. Uh, the mustache open is not. Nope. And that's awesome. It lives on through a new con. It does. It lives on through a new con. Uh, we have uh, the Warriors Weekend happening uh, April 6th and 7th uh, here in Victoria at the Bay Street Armory. Uh, go check it out. Facebook.com slash Warriors Weekend, I believe. Uh, or uh, search Warriors Weekend in Facebook. And uh, we are the only tabletop mini, I think. You'll find with that. Uh <laughs> But the Mustache Open will happen there. Uh, we are not going to be able to stream, but we will be recording. Um, it is actually a uh, Department of Canadian Department of Defense site, so there's no internet access there for us at all. <laughs> <laughs> um, I We're will... not even in. I think. I think if we pulled out an Ethernet cable, we might get shot. Right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Ethernet. Please hand them in at the door, sir. <laughs> so um, that's fine. Uh, we'll be just fine. I'm not going to get shot this Everything's year. Everything's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to get shot this year. This year. Yeah. This, this year. year. That's, that's right. Well, so that's, that's, your, that's your New Year's resolution. Well, I'm not going to get shot. If you set year. the bar low, it's <laughs> easy to get there. So <laughs> You're never disappointed in yourself. Right? That depends on what country you're in. Uh, well, okay. As long okay. as I stay in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> or at least uh, BC. Yep. So 
new uh, also new news um, is Wave 14 has been announced. Dun 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 dun. <clears throat> Can we tilt the laptop a bit more, Bally? No. I can't see the chat. No. Super good. There's chat? There's chat. <laughs> there's probably chat. I'm sure there's chat. Oh my goodness. You think you it's... can read the chat oh, from here? Oh, come on. I can't read the chat from here, and I think. Can you pull up the live dashboard a little bit? It's no. like a, what is that, a millimeter in size, the font? Like, literally. Is it a millimeter it's in small. size? Yeah. Like, literally it's small. a millimeter. Stay, it might stay be. on target. Stay on target. <laughs> it's, it's Zealand. It's easy to tangent. So, oh okay, God. wave 14. Wave 14 is out. I personally am super. Super duper excited. There's a D65 being released. Oh, maybe they're going to fix them. Okay. Are they going to fix them? So Titles? Uh, titles? Titles? Is it? Titles? It's gotta be. I don't know. It's New gotta modifications? Be. <clears throat> it's got to be. So, it's fix it. Okay, okay, so the two sets are the Saw's Renegade expansion, which appears to have a U-wing and a uh, X-wing, both in the partisan colors, the black and the white color scheme. Okay. Which I think looks super good. Okay. Um, and the Thai Reaper, which looks like a cross between a shuttle and a Thai Striker. And it looks like kind of a. It, to personally, I looked at that and I looked at the uh, uh, point cost and the number of crew slots on it and I went, You're the cheapest pulp carrier I've ever seen in my life. I love you. I think I remember that now. You re I remember that now from the movie. The thing? Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. that's what it looked yeah, like. Yeah, because yeah. it was like bigger than the other two strikers. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It was two strikers beside it, yeah. right? Yeah, flying yes. wingman on it. Was it two yeah. strikers flying beside it, and then it was just slightly bigger with a bigger fuselage yeah. and more square. Yeah. It was like, uh, yeah. So that is where, so that one little shot from the movie. And boom, we, and new, we've got a oh new man, model. Are you kidding me? The I whole love it. Anytime I watch <clears throat> X-Wing, I'm watching it for the um, uh, actual maneuvers and ships and the pilots because I think what, that's stuff that FFG can draw from. That's stuff FG, FFG is going to use, right? Please, please, can yeah. you guys? Well, please, I'd love that. All the ships they can, right? Um, Obviously. You can actually, if you hit the three dots, you can hit pop out chat. And just make it full screen and then just close the dashboard. Blam. Hello, David. I hope you're still watching. <laughs> Yay! Hey, it's three millimeters now instead of one millimeter. Oh, no, you painted size. a Poe and then they came out with a Poe. Yeah, that's a thing that happens. So, that's so, yeah. the... What... what well, what's it going to be able to do? Do you uh, know anything about uh, it? Okay, I don't know a whole lot about it, but uh, <clears> let's <throat> let's talk about the new um, um, the, the Saws Renegades. Yeah, yeah. That's so like, we got a T sixty five and a U wing and a looks like a raft of new pilots. I love the colors on these, and there is speculation that um, you're actually going to be able to open and close the S foils on this X wing. No. Uh, I don't know if that's true or not. I I hope so. God, I hope so. That would be fantastic. As cool as that would be, I don't know if I'd want that more moving parts mm. for a tiny little plastic object. Mm. It's super uh, easy to break. Yeah, but they give you a warranty on them. If you say, hey, it broke, they'll send you a new, new ship. So, Honestly, I'd love to see it. I don't think it's going to happen. They're going to take exactly the same X-Wing sculpt they've been doing. Because it is they, the yeah. it's the exact duplicate of... Of the T sixty five, so why would you just repaint it? Yeah, yeah. Like, why would you change the model? I for that? really hope they throw some titles in there. At um, least one. We're hoping bolster it up somehow. Give that X wing a there, little bit more. There oomph. appear to be some things like uh, an S foils T sixty five only modification. Ooh, uh, T sixty five only another, mods. It looks like maybe it's a flip mod. Okay, uh, for the S foils. And then uh, a couple of unique pilots, or sorry, a couple of unique crew uh, to go on there. It looks like you know, you're going to get another flight assist. Uh, looks like, yeah, uh, definitely some titles. Uh, Renegade something or other. Nice. Uh, and then Saw himself. Uh, when attacking, you may suffer one damage. Uh, one... 
A lot of fun damage, damage to change one of your gear. focus results to a crit. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. uh, that could be super good with Nora. Mm -hmm. Fly him with Nora, get that extra focus result. I'll take that damage on my with my R2 and uh, turn that crit up. Cool. That could be scary, man. Hmm. Yeah. And he's only one point. Because you gotta cheap. take that damage. So yeah, if, yeah, he's cheap. If you can put him on something that'll regen, it's not so bad. Yeah, that's true. So and new. Where is it? That's here? actually quite damage dealing. I think so. I think that potential. it's got a lot of potential. Uh, the new scrambled condition from the targeting scrambler on the U uh, that uh, uh, comes with it. It's a new uh, system, uh, unique. So you can only have one in your list. Uh, at the start of the planning phase, you may receive a weapons disabled token to choose a ship at range 1 to 3 and assign it the scrambled condition. Uh, with the scrambled condition saying, uh, when attacking a ship at range uh, 1 that is equipped with the targeting scrambler upgrade, you cannot modify your attack dice. At the end of the combat phase, remove this card. Whoa! Wait, you cannot modify your you attack dice. You cannot scramble. And so, so no tokens, no ability rerolls, no nothing. Nothing. Flat wow. rolls. Nice. Yep. So that's powerful. I think so. Um, combine that with uh, Fen, and you could have some really tanky U wings. Yeah. So some really tanky, hell, a tanky ghost. Some serious control. A really tanky ghost, even. That's mm. a system slot. It could go on the ghost. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I don't know when you want to take that weapons. To, oh. Is that is that is that re, uh, rebel only or resistance nope. only? Or anything? Nope, no, it's no. just unique. Okay, so you can only have one in your list. Uh, you zero it? points. You have to take a weapons okay. disabled. You have to take the weapons disabled token. So there's a cost to it. There is a cost. But so it's there's not that ways bad. to get what are what are ways to get rid of that weapons disabled token? Do the the gunboats don't have a system slot, so you can't do stuff can't like wasabi. Um, well, who knows? We'll see. We'll see. And then, of course, the oldie tie reaper. Oh my god. Oh my god. You can put him on a oh B-Wing. Oh, sorry. Um, oh, there it is. Okay. You could put that on a B-Wing. Would that be... That could be really useful for any low agility ship, really. That needs to get out and away and turn around like a B-Wing needs to. Mm -hmm. That could work. Hmm. So, TIE Striker is a small base ship, uh, two crew slots. Well, oh, sorry, not the Striker. Sorry, the Reaper. The Reaper. <laughs> the Reaper. It looks sorry. a lot like the Striker, though. Tie I know! <laughs> TIE Striker Shuttle? Yeah. yeah. There we go. There you go. So, the Reaper has two crew slots, okay. and, and, and at least showing here on the uh, highest pilot skill, uh, which is Major Vermeil, Vermeil? has uh, an EPT slot and is 26 points. Has focus, evade, and jam as an action. Ooh, jam. Could be two useful. crew slots. Two crew Again, slots. that could be and like jam. That could be take a weapons disabled. And that could be useful there as well. No system slot one. though. No, si no system slot. Um, three, def uh, three attack dice, one defense dice, six hull, two shields. Wow, that's so tanky. It's and beef. what's it to do? He's twenty six. Um, uh, he uh, one agility. One agility. So it doesn't it doesn't shift doesn't uh, dodge much, but uh, it's got a pretty good uh, primary weapon, and it'll take some hits before it goes down. Yeah, oh so yeah. as long as you have something else scarier yeah. or something else that can tank for it, <clears throat> I think you'll do okay. I mean, <clears throat> the the two shields is good. It's better not having shields at all. I yeah. I personally love shields because there there's lots of ways of regening them in the game. There's there's other yeah things that you can use with shield tokens but um and they're also crit Hot mobile a captain name i agree jay what's that he says that uh that, that the uh yeah. system the scramble scrambler should go on either cop mobile or nim mm. so yeah i think so too yeah i like the idea of putting it on cop mobile yeah. even if it's just on an old school cop zero mobile. it's zero instead of collision detector you put this one instead and hey Jesus, suddenly that shuttle's a tank. Yeah. So. Whoa. 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 Oh. Hey. Almost. I, you know, yeah. we don't need the waterworks. Trying to kill 
That's that damn phone oh, and stuff. I it's guess. soaking yeah. it up. It's oh, like it is. It is it's a sponge. It, it, it totally sucked it all up. Mmm, glass neoprene. Well, that's okay. Your your carbo cardboard tokens can suck them, suck the moisture back. Uh, cardboard tokens can get. Can they go hang this up now? <laughs> <laughs> you guys can't even talk about yourselves. Talk about ourselves. <sighs> Amongst about whatever. So. What Good lists? Old stick us nine fingers here. What <laughs> what lists were really in the meta then at the regionals that you went to? Oh man, I don't know because I was on the bottom tables. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, no, I went two and four for the uh, for the two days uh, or for the first day, sorry, uh, and then I went two and one on the hangar bay the next day. Okay. Uh, hangar bay was the really the highlight of the whole event for me. Really? Yeah, it was so much damn fun. Uh, shenanigans lists, shenanigans lists in the hangar bay. The first guy I faced, I did my um, bomber Nim and Ezra uh, that I've been having a lot of fun with, mm -hmm. and he faced me with three U wings at PS two. U wings. U wings. Okay. With fire control system and advanced, advanced proton, proton torpedoes. torpedoes. Ooh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was like, wow. Sorry? If he can get, if he gets a hit on me, it's gonna hurt. He didn't get anything. Really. He didn't get anything. No, he didn't. Nothing. Nothing he didn't. happened. No, I so, bombed. But... I bombed him so hard, so hard <laughs> that I got. In one turn, I reduced one of his U wings to one hull and two shields. <laughs> Because I, I had all my bombs lined up just perfectly. He came in and bumped my bomber, and my bomber was like, "Well, I'm stuck here." And stopped everybody from uh or, or or kept everybody there another turn so that he could drop another bomb afterwards <laughs> it was it was beautiful it was, it was beautiful. beautiful oh man and i don't think i actually shot any of his ships and hit them it was all bomb damage no way yeah it, that's awesome it, it was great Shredded but with bombs. that's what happens when you bring three u-wings yeah. to the tournament man like, <laughs> Yeah, and that was his. That was his less comp list. He was like, "That's my fun list," and he ended up flying into that the rest of the time that I fought. Okay, so. but I uh, how I did with it. Uh, Andrew, <laughs> shout out to Andrew Lawrenson. If you're watching, buddy, good on you. He managed to get into the top sixteen. Hey, uh, all made, right. Made only one from the island that made it made top sixteen. Uh, Ray and I were not surprised, but also disappointed. You know, mm -hmm. when you were like, "Yeah, I knew I wasn't good enough." But damn, it sucks to be reminded that you're just not good enough, you know? So, but uh, no, we had a lot of fun. It was good times. It was yeah, good times. That's, yeah, that's awesome. That's um, awesome. Lists that, were, that I think did do well were um, the Fen shuttle, or sorry, uh, Fen in the shuttle with uh, the uh, Ghost with the dock shuttle. Uh, variations on that, often the Maul one. It was Maul sensor jammer with docked Ezra and go fuck yourself it was <laughs> terrible <laughs> like, oh, the the amount of damage that that thing could just punish you with was oh, yeah. ridiculous <laughs> from any range really as long as you the only safe place you could get to it was range one on the side <laughs> yeah and even then when you got thought you got there he'd be like nope Finn's gonna coordinate a boost and uh, <laughs> oh god damn it <laughs> now, gonna now, die now. now I'm range one of his rear attack yeah, five dice that bam. that reposition at PS11 is ridiculously powerful and I that is my current NPE experience my, that's my ne negative play experience <laughs> <laughs> giving somebody another action at Pilot skill 11, yep. after everyone's already moved, is very powerful. It's ridiculously useful. Uh, <laughs> ridiculously useful. After, after I went 2 and 1 in the morning, I, I made a pact with myself. I said, any time that I see Fen on the table against me, I don't care about anything else. Fen must die. I don't care if I sacrifice everything to get there. I will kill him first. <laughs> I failed to meet my goal because in my last match of the day on the first day, I faced off against a fan ghost. It was Kanan. It was Sensei Jammer. I think I might have done a single damage to Fen in the entire match. <laughs> Rough. Yeah. It's, uh, it's bad rough. news. It was yeah, Kanan with Sensei Jammer and some way to generate focus is 
is crazy tanky. Yes. Crazy yep. tanky well, for the whole list. And especially <laughs> with Fen Rao's ability, you give him a hotshot co-pilot so that he strips somebody's uh, uh, focus. And then when somebody else activates, the next big bad activates, <laughs> you go, wait, 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 I'll take a stress. And you don't get to modify your dice with tokens this turn. <laughs> Whoop! Focus I held on to. Oh, that target lock. Totally useless. <laughs> uh, what do we got there? Hey, nice to see you. Thanks for joining us, Game Nexus. Yeah, we decided we'd try something a little different. And I kind of like the way this is working out. Um, yeah, so regionals were good. And um, I think next year we're going to be back and we're actually going to try to live stream it. Um, good. I talked to them and I said, hey, I'd love to do this. And before I even really finished what I was saying, um, they were like, yes, please, please come in. Yeah, that'd be <laughs> great. We'd love to have you. So I'll, uh, I will definitely be going and be not cool. competing next year. You know what? I'll probably have way more fun. Oh, probably. <laughs> you get to see every single game, get to just flutter around and look at lists. I don't have to stress out for five weeks beforehand going, what am I going to fly? Go, go talk to the best players available and say, hey, do you mind if we record your, uh, your right? semifinal match here? Exactly. Damn go it! for it! Wave 16 dropped just before regionals and it's legal! <laughs> uh, we get it here on the island two days before! <laughs> or yeah. not at all and somebody else who pre-ordered it online gets it. Anyway, but that's a discussion for a totally different time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, should we... I don't think there's much more to cover right now. Should we get into our match? Yes, absolutely. All right, so we're going to take a quick break while we rearrange a couple things and uh, get the... Get uh, the uh, dirt rolling. Get going and get the dirt flowing. <laughs> get the dirt flowing. Uh, so... Thank you, everybody, for joining us on our uh, first uh, Geek Tech Industries uh, live stream live in your face. Our yammering. The yammer. The yammer. Geek Tech Yammer. That's not, that's, it's got a ring to it, but I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <laughs> so, if you got an idea for a name for this, I know, If you got an idea for a name for this, let us know in the comments and uh, see, you know, let, let us know what you think. There's going to be some, I'm sure, very shortly. All right. So, yeah, we'll be back. Soon-ish.